This is the TVnews.tv, brought to you by American Ingenuity Media, simply the solution for innovative on-air promotion, video marketing, plus internet and social marketing. Visit them at AmericanIngenuityTV.com and on Facebook. Here now is Jeff Grimshaw. Welcome to the TVnews.tv. It's Wednesday, February 1st, and we begin with the long-awaited rival of former Turner Entertainment and CNN showbiz guy, Bill Tush. Bill regales us with his view of the TV industry with As Seen on TV, which begins right now. Hello, I'm Bill Tush. Some of you may know me from my days as a semi-regional cable star in the glory days of TBS or from CNN. I'm happy to say that I've signed a very lucrative contract with the folks here at TV News. And I look forward to being the contributor and highlighting my long and illustrious career that is taking me from some of the most glamorous spots in the world of show business to here, my room, with the camera I bought at Radio Shack. But what else do you need in television? You know, the entire business has changed. It's not what it used to be. I remember as a kid thinking of how exciting it must be to work in television. Occasionally, there'd be a behind-the-scenes glimpse and you'd get to see the cameras and the lights and all the glamour. Once I even saw our local anchorman in person. I was amazed. He was in color. Well, hopefully in the weeks to come, if I last that long, let me take a look at this contract here. Well, we'll be talking about a lot of things, the good and bad of television. We'll be talking occasionally about movies, and we might even talk about the theater. After all, NBC is doing a really big push about a new show called Smash, behind the scenes of a Broadway show. It's hoped that that show will cause an interest in live theater, much the way HBO's Six Feet Under created a boom in the embalming trade. There's just so much to talk about and shows to discuss. Well, just this morning I glanced at the on-demand lineup to see, um, you know, what to watch and uh, what choices there were. I came across 24-hour catalog. Now here's the description, I'm not kidding you. For the first challenge, the four designers must take an oversized football jersey and create a stylish look for the contemporary soccer mob. Well, my night's planned. Now we know why God invented the 50-inch flat screen television. Let's not forget those other shows. Parking Wars, Storage Wars, Shipping Wars, or just flip to the History Channel for wars. Or wait, I think those shows are on the History Channel. Well, look, I've got to get back to my TV, and I'll see you next time. From the Keith Overman No Budget Studio here in Television City, I'm Bill Tosh. And uh, who's this Tasho guy, anyway? Well, sad to report the best laid plans can sometimes go technically awry, and that's just what happened to Bill Tush's inaugural as seen on TV commentary, but we will get everything ironed out in the days ahead, we promise. The Programming Pulse, brought to you by Combridge's website design, internet marketing, and social media strategies. Visit them at combridges.com. February 5th. You know it better as Super Bowl Sunday, but there's another major sports event happening that very same day. The fur will fly at 3 p.m. Eastern when Puppy Bowl 8 kicks off on Animal Planet, and this perennially high-rated event will, of course, also feature the Kitty Halftime Show, plus the Piggy Pep Squad, and Animal Planet gets social marketing because they'll have a parrot tweeting right on the field. And on a darker note, we move to the X Factor Massacre in which Paula Abdul, Nicole Scherzinger, and host Steve Jones were all issued their walking papers. Now, that leaves only Simon Cowell and L.A. Reid in the now decimated talent ranks. And as they say in sports, looks like the X Factor is in rebuilding mode. And finally, I am putting my preferences in news networks aside to congratulate Fox News 
which one decade ago passed CNN like it was standing still in the ratings and has remained king of the cable news network hill for 10, count them, 10 years straight. <laughs> Pains me to say this, but congratulations, Fox News. I'm Susan Hibben, and my next report will be available next Wednesday here on the TVnews.tv. Well, all right, on Friday, February 3rd, get set for former CNN Uber anchor Bobby Batista as she delivers her exclusive Eye on News report. We want you as a sponsor of the TV news so you can talk to the entire TV industry in our native tongue video. To learn more about how you can leverage the power of the TV news, email us at advertise at the TV news.tv. And that about does it for this edition of the TV news. We invite you to hang with us on our social media outlets. And here are all of those coordinates. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. We thank you very much for watching. And as always, go out and make it a good day. Specially formulated to meet your specific needs, the Monavi elements are revolutionizing how you approach your health. Built on the Monavi BioEssence Promise, each of these health pack supplements works with your body to promote your best self. Monavi, a more meaningful life.